and girls, welcome aboard. Good evening! Welcome, welcome, warmest of welcomes to you. My name is Daniel, and I'm your cruise director here on this beautiful ship. I can see some familiar faces. Welcome back, welcome back. Do we have any first-time cruisers with us? <gasps> Where have you been? You've missed out on all the fun. You've got a lot of catching up to do. Anyone cruised a few times? Five times? Ten times? Ooh. Wow, those are the rich ones. Hang around with them. <laughs> well, I'm sure for a lot of the people that are cruising for the first time, you're struggling to adapt. You've got into your cabin, you've unpacked 10% of your suitcase, you're wandering around the ship aimlessly, you've got lost about 50 times already, you're eating once every 20 minutes, your waistline has already expanded. I know, I know, times are tough. And I'm sure you're bursting with questions. And I've been asked some of the best questions throughout the years. One particular favorite of mine is And I, of course, always come back with a totally dishonest, insincere answer of, no, madam, they do not. They are actually flown in from their respective countries, all 50 nationalities, by a helicopter. And then at the end of their working day, they go home by a dolphin, which we now have to tip because of new maritime law. Yes, it's an expensive game, but hey, for you guys, it's worth it. Are you still One woman actually called from her cabin down to reception and declared, I'm trapped! I can't leave my cabin! To which we replied, Madam, just, just go through the front door. And she said, well, there's two doors. There's one that leads to the toilet and another one that says, do not disturb. <laughs> gentleman came to me and said is the uh, in the toilet there is it is it fresh water or is it actually a salt sea water <laughs> why do you care what, what, are you having sleepless nights wondering about this and I obviously came back to him and said I'm not gonna check I don't know for two reasons a number one and a number two <laughs> No, it's good. Yeah? Just it's good. Just a little too serious. Too serious. Yeah. What Maybe do I need? Can you do some funny? Something funny? Something funny? Like what? Like Maybe impressions? Impressions. I could do Pumba from Lion King. Come on, sure. When I was a young wood. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Now, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to let you in on a little secret. As a previous performer myself, we thrive on the energy that you give us. Every evening, when you come to this theatre, which you 100 million percent will, you are actually a part of the show. This car, behind this curtain, will come out here and do a fantastic job. With that said, whatever you give them energy-wise, they will only give you back tenfold. So they are going to want to hear you clap. They are going to want to hear you scream. They're going to want to hear you clap and scream and sing and dance in and out of your seats. I'm glad to see we're having a good time already. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, without any further ado, please welcome to the stage your production show this evening and tonight's show of Legends. 